Hi guys, so my camera battery died when we came out of the cake store so I did not get to tell you guys what happened at the cake store. So we were browsing around and Stefan was um, asking um, you know, the guys in the store for help and so on and then he met this young lady and she, um, he asked her for something. He went up to her. He went up to her and asked her um, a few questions to help with the cake stuff. <clears throat> and she was so helpful she started telling us um, different things and she really gave good advice like she like she knew what she was talking about and then when we actually got down to it we realized that she is a celebrity cake chef and her Instagram is called lovely layers Yes, I am giving her a shout out, Antoinette of Lovely Layers. Thank you so much. We got so much help from you, so many different ideas and so on. And she even told us call her anytime if we need any help with um, the cake and so on because the cake is actually for Clement Sisters wedding on Sunday. Oh, she was so nice. She was so nice. And then she started telling us that she made cakes for Tamar Braxton and Michael Jai. Is Michael Jai or Jalil White? And Music Soul Child. And I'm like, what? So we actually got to meet a celebrity. I said, no, no. You're a celebrity cake artist, but you're also a celebrity in itself. <laughs> Yes, this is so cool and she actually was on Food Network with another of her friend Chick Sugars I'm now looking at the Instagram here that's the both of them there on a show called Winner Cake All she was she was um, on the show in March she yeah she has some really nice cakes on her um, on her site so I will leave her link in the description box if any of you are in Brooklyn, New York, you can check her out and I guess um, from wherever you are you can check her out as well and check her on Instagram and she also has a, she also has a website www.mylovelylayers.com I really really had to shout her out because she was so cool and she helped us with so much I didn't even think she had planned to stay so long in the in the cake store but she stayed and helped us out and I and we are really really grateful hubby is not here right now he went back to the road but I just wanted to come and say thank you thank you thank you to Antoinette of lovely layers for helping us out you were a godsend and if you guys watch Food Network, check out the episode 10, I think, Winner Cake All that aired um, in March, sometime in March. So you guys check it out. <sighs> I must say that God has been really blessing us on this trip. First, we met Chloe and Holly. Well, I met Chloe and Holly because Hobby didn't, Hobby wasn't um, nearby when they were there. And then we met celebrity cake artist ah, God is working and I did say that April will be a month of April will be my month of breakthrough and I'm already seeing it happening first um, I launched my business my new a new um, aspect of my business natural designs I went out to an event I haven't been to an expo or event in years probably three or four years I launched my t-shirt line the I am natural Bell collection and of course I will have those that information link below so you guys can go and check it out I did a video on my main channel in case you didn't know about that I made the announcement on my main channel and I am traveling this is the furthest I've been to I got my visa in April and I'm traveling this is the first time I've been to New York first time I've been to Jamaica Wow I am hoping that this month will just continue being a month of blessings and breakthrough break and I thank God for 
each and every one the small ones and the big ones even us getting that visa on time thank you lord for that and on saturday it will be our fifth wedding anniversary so yay for april i wasn't born in april but april is really turning out to be my favorite month this year yes yes to all those april bonds <laughs> Anyways, um, I am going to have a late lunch. Um, Hobby and his sister went out to get some stuff on the road. I stayed back because I wanted to do um, a coaching session for a beta program that I am testing out that a coach um, asked me to test out. Yes, I am doing a... a an intense program for the week so I have to meet one hour from Monday to Thursday and I think half an hour on Friday can't remember but yeah so this is the third day so far and I'm so glad that I've been able to make it it's from three to four so I'm glad that I've been able to be online in time for the live session um, and it has been really uh, yeah so um what was i saying yeah i was talking about how many different things that has been happening really good things positive things small things big things um in this month and i'm really really grateful and thankful to god for working things out um but i don't even think i got back to tell you guys the story with Chloe and Holly but they were really really sweet and they were actually speaking to someone I'm not sure if that's their brother or their publicist or manager or whoever I'm not sure but he was with them um, the younger guy was their brother because when we wanted to when I asked them for the picture they actually said um, you know asked if I wanted a brother to take a picture and I wish I did I wish I did but anyways I still got a selfie you know I'm big for the crown so yes and they were really really sweet and they were you know like really into listening to what I had to say and, so, and I'm like wow that is so sweet and even when they I think they went in the airport and then they passed back and they're like bye see you later you know enjoy and whatnot and i'm like oh they're so sweet there was something i said and they were like oh in unison like twins like when twins say stuff in unison so so far i am really enjoying this um just i've been feeling a little drained of course because we had a busy week um preparing for the event and before that I was well and yeah from the beginning of March right up until the beginning of April coming down right to before we flew in was just either very hectic or I wasn't well or something of the sorts I guess now that we're here you know everything is kind of coming down but I'm taking it in strides I'm not pushing too much and of course it's very very cool I have to wear the, I have to double up my clothes <sighs> the thing with my feet is happening off and on the worst was Sunday night I I don't know but I drank some ginger and garlic tea and I'm thinking it's done so I kind of held off of it to see it's happening but not as bad and like so far I got it in like one toe yesterday in my right foot and then the next today when we went out just the tip of my toe started getting out a little tingly <clears throat> and we did walk up and down a bit in that store but it's like a close the aisles are close so it's not like you had to do big stretches to walk so that was good and then from there we had to come home then get one right so that's how it is going I guess when next week when things settle down we will get to visit more places and so on so the vlogs will be a bit more interesting i cannot wait 
and also I have some family members around so I want to visit them and stuff check them out so, yeah see you in the next one I'm not sure what we're doing later but if they're if they're doing any cooking and so on I'll try to get that in if not highly doubt I might be going out again for the evening but we'll see so if not I'm closing